Hello! So, second video within just two days. I'm impressed. I'm getting back to my old, well, glory. <laughs> yeah, uh, the reason I'm making this is because I am really excited. Um, yeah, we just had a rehearsal in my acting group. And uh, the part that I have in Hamlet, it's so cool. I don't know whether I've mentioned that before. I know I have, but some videos got deleted, so I don't know. Um, but I have, uh, I'm not playing a failure, but uh, whew, I don't even know what his name is in English. Probably has a different name. In German, it's Guldenstern. Um, it's one of the two actors who are kind of homeless right now and uh, not dangerous anymore. Ah, oh, that was... Oh. Yeah, I exchanged those words. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm just, um, I'm really excited about that. Because, um, apparently I have stolen a monologue now from... The other actor, Rosenkranz, and uh, it's just a really great monologue because it's actual acting, you know, it's supposed to be really good, so that's a whole lot of fun. <sighs> I haven't felt that alive in ages, it's just acting, you know, makes me so happy. Um, yeah, and um, another good thing is, I've already told at least some of you that my dad is kind of like a rock star. That he does all sorts of things and writes musicals, and um, he's doing one in October. And uh, it wasn't, uh, yeah, that's that's like my headphones. Yay! Um, it wasn't clear whether I would be available to um, be in it because uh, Hamlet is supposed to premiere at the same time. But I've just begged and begged and begged until. We've pushed that premiere date to, you know, the one for my acting. I'm just going to call them Exil Theater because that's what they are. Um, I've uh, managed to make them push it back a week. So now I can be in both. I'm really excited about that. Because then I'll get to be in two plays. And one of them is a musical and I'll get to sing. And that's just awesome. Oh, happy about that. So... Yeah, just thought I should mention that because I'm happy. I mean, not that I'm not happy usually, but right now I'm really bubbling over with excitement and yeah. <laughs> I wish I could do my loud, happy laugh because it sounds like a perfectly good evil laughter. But I'll just do that some other time when my parents aren't asleep. Ah, <sighs> yeah. Mm. Other things to look forward to, because now I have a whole lot of great things to look forward to. Uh, the first thing, obviously, is... You know what it is? It's... Starship! <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, it's, that's gonna be awesome. And the weeks following it on Facebook, those are really gonna be great, because it's gonna be phenomenal on the circuit potter page there are going to be so many new quotes and do you remember that time when um abps came out and uh, those of us who were already with them we like checked into youtube every other day or every other hour to see whether there were new comments that we could like i mean i did that i know i did that so that's really great um i i should probably I uh, apologize before that happens because I might accidentally abuse this channel to like a whole lot of comments and to write comments because I might forget to log out. I don't know yet, but it's um, not unrealistic, that scenario, so... Ooh, you have been warned. <sighs> I can hardly breathe because I'm talking so much. Mm. Okay, uh, yeah, I'm really excited about that, obviously. Now that uh, I know that it's going to be up at 4am on May 1st, which is kind of unfair because I get to see it like 
later than you guys, but and again, we get to see that at the same time, which is strange, but you know what I mean. And um, that means I can still help my acting group, Exil Theater, to uh, take the stuff from one place to the other, so that doesn't interfere with anything. That's great. I'll be pretty tired in the evening, slash night, slash morning, but it's still gonna be great. It's gonna be totally awesome. Who'd have thought? You know, like this. Where is it? Whoa, ha, 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 there. Um, yeah. I have things to be excited about. Did you know I only have five days of school left? And then I'm gonna be out of there forever. And that's so, so great. Because I hate this school. I really, really, really hate this school. And, uh, I'm, I'm gonna be out of it. I'm never gonna have to see the people again that I don't like. And the teachers that suck. And the school, which is horrible and grey and disgusting. And it's not disgusting, it's just cold and ugly. Really cold and really ugly. Yeah. I'm just really glad to be out of it. Um, Meg, I think you asked that question, or someone asked you that question. Um, what type of senior you are. Well, I, I'm just calling myself a senior, even though we have a totally different system. And uh, I have to say, I'm the kind that's like, oh my god, get me out of this place. It's so about time. It has been for like at least three years, because I've always wanted to get out of this place. It's so, so such a waste of life and time and beauty. Okay, that was strange. It's a waste of life and time. And beauty. Yeah. Um, okay, other things to look forward to. After those last five, five days of school, we're going go, yeah, we're going to go to Berlin with my history class. Five days, and Berlin is like the coolest thing in Germany, so <laughs> that's going to be really great. And um, it's also historically very interesting, which I didn't appreciate the last time I was there, which was only for a weekend when I was 13. But it was still, no, I think it was 15. I, I, anyway, it was a very long time ago. And, yeah, so we're going to have a whole lot of great stuff and um, interesting stuff. And also, of course, uh, great nightlife, because it's Berlin. That's going to be great. And uh, I actually like most of the people, or, well, I get along with them. Uh, the people who are going with me... I am going with those people, and um, the teachers are okay too, so yeah, that's going to be great. Looking forward to that. And then I'll have two fr two free weeks, or one free week, I'm not entirely sure. And then on June 1st, um, I will officially graduate. And um, there'll be a ball and everything, not as cool as prom, or cool, if prom is cool, I don't know. Some people think it's cool, some people think it's corning, some people think it's prom. Some people think it's prom, you know. And um, that's that's going to be kind of cool, because I never get to be pretty. And I have this cool dress. I mean, not cool, but it's a nice dress. I hardly ever wear dresses at school, especially not, you know, the pretty kind. And uh, I'm, I'm going to have my hair done and re-dyed, so... It'll actually be red again. Nicely red. I'm looking forward to that. And curled. My hair looks so good when it's curled. And I've, I'll probably have makeup done by a real makeup artist. So that's going to be cool. Because, like I said, I never get to be pretty at school. I'm always the ugly duggling. And this time, I'm going to be a swan. Yeah. That was very, very cliched and corny and sappy and kind of horrible, cheesy, yeah cheesy is the right word, but um, I'm still looking forward to it, I still have to buy shoes and make a, make two appointments, one for the makeup and one for the hair, but it's gonna work itself out, everything's gonna be okay, oh my god look at that, there's like ink on it, cause I write with black ink, you should know that about me black ink or green ink, never blue, I hate blue ink. 
Oh, okay. And um, after that, I will be officially out of school, never have to be there again. And then I'll have three months of freedom until I have to start whatever I'm going to start. And in that time, I will definitely go to the Hippie Festival I've already mentioned, which is going to be so great because we're going to be there for five days, and or at least three possibly five, and it's just so beautiful there, and so, so there's so much color, and belief, and good in the world, and joy, and I'm serious about that, you should really experience that, it's, um, I don't know, you have to be open to it in order to enjoy it, but if you let yourself be open about the world, then this is going to be the greatest place. Because all of a sudden, everyone's going to live in harmony. And yeah, that sounds horrible. Because most people think it's it's uh, it's horrible to be so naive. But I'll tell you one thing, it feels good to be naive every once in a while. And I'm going to buy new clothes. <laughs> and eat all this great food. And I'm, I'm going to try being vegetarian afterwards. Well, at least as soon as I move out. Even though I really love meat. I love meat. But, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna try to be vegetarian. So, not vegan. I don't see any reason to become vegan. But there probably are some. I'm not gonna do that to myself, because I love eggs. They're very convenient. Um, Milk, not so much, but you still need it for a whole lot of stuff. I don't like to drink milk, which is beside the point. But yeah, okay, so that's something I'm looking forward to. And uh, yeah, then I'm probably going to go watch w w Wicked. Possibly with my dad, because he expressed interest in coming with me. Though I'm not sure about that yet, but I think I will definitely watch. So... I hope that doesn't ruin it for me, because it's in German, and German translations suck, I've already said that. that. So, hmm. then more holidays. Then I will go to Tuscany for a week with my acting group. Afterwards, um, I will probably uh, go to Croatia with my parents. Or, well, I will follow them, follow them there in a car with my sister's boyfriend because he can only be there late too so I don't have to go there by myself even though I probably would prefer that because I like singing and listening to my music especially on a long journey journey and yeah I, I would prefer going by myself but at least this way I don't have to pay all the money for the car right so yeah um, and I can drive. Oh my god, I'm looking forward to that. Um, yeah, and then I will have that workshop with stage school. And that's going to be for, what, five days? And that's going to be great or not. I'm going to figure out whether I want to do this or not. You know, go to stage school. If I will, I'm definitely going to go next year. Because I, I have a whole lot of obligations and I kind of don't want to move to Hamburg quite yet. But, yeah. That's going to be awesome. And then I'm going to start, um, probably start the year as a Waldorf teacher, uh, you know, studying that, becoming that. And that school is so beautiful. So that's really great. And then I, I will be in those two plays. I'm going to play in the musical. And yeah, <laughs> that's my awesome year. And then I will try wait for it, I will try to get to New York. If I can make enough money, though I kind of doubt that, I will definitely try to get to New York. You know, just for a week. And the, the autumn holidays, possibly. We have autumn holidays, isn't that great? Okay, and that was my list of things I am extremely excited about in this year. 2011 is so my year. And, yeah, hyper again, but I'm happy. Good. That's it. Goodbye. I love you. You're awesome. You're gonna have a great year too. I'm sure of it. Bye!